and 7.56. I slept in till 7, which is really good. Really happy. Um, did some yoga this morning. This is my mug that I drink coffee out of every day. I made more granola yesterday because we're out of the granola that I literally made less than a week ago. But I'm gonna go hike with my dad. He's gonna walk up from his house. It's another like day in my life, something. I really don't do anything exciting though. But I haven't been to the beach in two days and that's really weird because I live at the beach. So I re-downloaded TikTok and I don't know, I'm not sure how I feel about it. It's just not, I mean, it's fine, but I feel like I'm on my phone so much more now. Like last night, I like sat on it for like, like super long. And then I like woke up with a headache because I was staring at my phone. So, not gonna do that anymore. Yeah. Oh, I'm not eating dairy this whole week. Cause I wanna see if it, Cause up my skin but i didn't really eat a lot of dairy before just like greek yogurt if anyone has good acne tips let me know because it's not fun to deal with yeah oh and book recommendations i need more good books because i read through all my good books and i have a bunch of like non-fiction like self-help books sometimes those are not fun to listen to or read so let me know morning I woke up it's a new day did some yoga took a shower I'm gonna make a smoothie and I have to get my booster today so I'm gonna do that my skin feels clearer today and I stopped doing my um like skincare routine with like oil and this one cleanser it's like an oil based cleanser and I'm just using like CeraVe and not putting anything on it and it's clearing up and so it's really frustrating because I like did this whole like routine for like a month and was so like and then it's like i just need to do one simple thing but i guess that's a metaphor for life but i read a new book called the untethered soul and it's really about like mindfulness and i'm working on that and uh, it's very windy out but i got eight hours of sleep last night which is unheard of so i'm feeling alive yeah so 
that's all. Then I'm putting protein powder, maca powder, golden milk powder, coconut water, kale, banana, and mango. So, it's the party. untethered soul yeah. first chapter is talking about your roommate in your head and it's like your roommate, in your, head. your roommate in your head and it's like about taking like your inner thoughts and like putting them um like making it like an imaginary person and it's like would you be spending like amounts of time with this person and it's like no because they're fucking crazy like they're it's like your voice is like constantly going so like i challenge you to sit in the shower and like not think about um you're like just like be conscious of your thoughts and just like listen to your like conversation that you're having with yourself because in the end you're going to realize it makes absolutely no sense and it's just like this like inner voice that was Cassandra's recommendation. yeah and it was so like it was like so perfect, on, perfect yeah. time to start reading it. I read it last night and I just like couldn't focus. I was like reading it and I was like, this is gonna be like another one of those like self-help like boring books, but <laughs> guys, I wanna look like this girl. Let me show you my inspo for this summer. I want my hair to look like that. I want it. Yeah, you should. I feel like shit. How do you feel? I'm doing great. Just kidding. <laughs> this association is real, right? It's literally nine, but I feel like shit for my shot. So, gonna call it a night.